One second. We're going to jump over to this real quick. I'm going to make some minor comments and we're going to move forward. Personally, and this is just a critique that I've had with a lot of this. Right, so we go in here and we take a look at this, right? This is a span and this is a div and, and this is JS most likely running this. What I would say is you always want your title to be static. And then if you have something cute that does this, have it go once and stop. Unless you need it to showcase that you can delete it and change it. So like if this thing rotated through two or three things, that would be awesome sauce. But have your static piece up here. Oh, see, oh, that is awesome. Okay. I just didn't catch it. Hmm. Maybe the timing's wrong on this then. Yeah, the timing is wrong. Right, you need to check your timing on this because I didn't catch that. And also, if you have punctuation, make sure everyone has punctuation. Okay, but other than that, I like it. This, right, like as soon as they scroll down, I would just have that stop. But I would definitely have this at the top. This is feels like a lot of wasted space here and here. I'm just like, what? And I come down here. I like these, how they kind of motioned in, you know? Can I see them again? Oh, it doesn't do it again. Okay, there it is. I like these, you know, I like these little animations. Uh, you Oh, these are even cool. I would, I would say, can you do this not as a full cover over, but maybe like have it come in halfway, come in halfway. You kind of have like a little, ooh, be like, oh yeah, well, let me click on this. Uh, but these are all super minor. Like this is like ultra nitpicky. I like it. You have a lot of color. You have a lot of differential here. Uh, you know, maybe front end development projects. What does this go to? No. I would make this clickable then if this is just going to go here. I'd have it go to a different page, but that's me. Uh, projects. So this is this S level. S level. Hmm. What are the, what are these out of, you know, or is this like senior developer? And then if I mouse over these, can I have some tool tips? What does this even mean to me? Like, let's say I don't know what this one is. What does this mean to me? This one. Also, this spacing seems tight. And then did you intend for these to be two different colors on these sides? And then for these not, or maybe, Ooh, you know what'd be cool? And I mean, I'm just spitballing here, man. You saw where like you had this like little taste of the like the red there for a second. Like, I, like you saw that like there's that little taste. It'd be cool is if you had maybe their individual colors. Okay, that one was that one did not work as well. I lost Twitter. I like the idea behind this. You know what the problem is with this whole thing? Where's the button where I, like, if I click this, I should see a way to email you. Right, there is, how do I email you? Even on my, even on my little crappy um, page here, like, if you click here, I get an email thing, right? It pops right up. Super chill, super easy. Bam, just click on it. This even takes you to a tweet. Tweet at me. This one, if you're on a phone, it'll call me, right? This is garbage, by the way. Like, this is the absolute minimum you can do. I know, I've stripped this thing down to the smallest it can ever be and still be crummy enough to actually attract attention. Like, that's bad to say, but it's, yeah. Like, look at this thing. It's pixelated here. I, this is, I mean, we're getting an entirely new facelift. Right, this is where I went out and spent money. Uh, copy message link. We come in here. This is oh, that's a oh no. Okay, that's not exactly what I wanted. Uh, I just wanted to copy the link. This is still the same garbage link to Discord. No, okay, that's the actual link to the thing. 
right? And you can even see it mouses over and shows all these things. So yeah, there's a whole bunch of stuff that's getting done here. Like this, this white on this gray needs to have a pop differential. This blue is a bad blue against this kind of pixelated thing. And a lot of it's so that it does dynamic sizing, right? So if I went like this, right, it doesn't do anything here, but if it's on the mold device, it will. So just some stuff to take in consideration on yours, right? It, I just, it says some ways to contact me. I don't know. I would be short. Contact me, colon. Or connect. Connect with me. Right? If you really want to, like, I, 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 maybe English isn't your first language on this, right? But some of these things, you really want to spell it out, right? Like, call to action. Like, if you come down here, and maybe one of these things are secretive, and it's like, see something you love? Click it. Right? And maybe even have a, you know, contact me in this series right here. And then it automatically has this as part of the information for that header. Does that make sense? I like that you use Firebase. I really do, man. That That is like key. I like this to-do list. You know, you have a lot of experience. Have you ever done Chrome extensions? I don't think you can do free ones. Whoa, man. Whoa. I'd almost make this. Because, look, hey, here, look. You have home, goes here, right? You have projects, takes you here. You have S level, takes you all the way down here. And you don't even have contacts on this, but your S skills takes you to a different page. Do you see something wrong with that? I like, I love this, like, Partial gradient coloring. I love the like the you know all this little extra hover stuff. Uh, I'm not sure what that is. Oh, okay, that's kind of weird. I would definitely put this somewhere here because it was hidden, right? If I go back and then I go to skills, it doesn't show me that top thing, and so when I hang around, it jumps. So I would just have it pinned to the top. Make sense? Like next JS, that's a good you know, you have a whole bunch of stuff in here. But it, it this needs to like this needs to feel like a client site just as much as your client site stuff needs to feel like one. If if mine if I was doing web stuff, I'd have to throw this away. Right? The only thing that I do is e-commerce things. And mine's not so much about the website piece. It's about how do you integrate databases and stuff like that, right? And how do you actually connect uh, payment services? Like that's where my specialty stuff is. How do you connect products and pay services to like UPS billing services and stuff? So that's where like my e-commerce thing is comes in. Like Shopify, I have a whole Shopify partnership thing, right? Meh. Do I really care about it? No. But it's out there because I'm supposed to advertise it. But with yours, man, that's like, I could, how do I get back? Right? So let's say I clicked here. How do I get back from this? How do I get back to any of your other things? And then, I mean, it, I'm, I'm, I don't know. I'm, I'm just adding more things in here. Like the tools. I love this. this is great. It'd be cool if there's like a, you, you found a free SVG image and you put like it next to it. This kind of feels more haphazard, like it was one of the earlier things. This is so much work. Oh, what do you mean? I mean, there's just a lot of stuff in here. Like, what does Windows 10 mean? It's a tool. I don't, I don't see Windows 10 as a tool. Maybe Hyper Terminal. Yeah, I could see that one. Maybe. Hmm. Right. Everything in general is so much work. Yeah, okay, yeah. It, it, But it's about the tiers and all that stuff you put into it, right? Cloning this is not going to make you good. 